Well, here we are for this week's episode of Victory Games, and we're gonna have a little sort of Victory MasterChef challenge. So four of the stars of the Melbourne Victory are, are here to uh, show me how good they are in the kitchen. Boys, this is what I call a pressure test. You've got the recipe, you've got all the ingredients, you've got the kitchen, I'm gonna give you guys 20 minutes to cook this dish. You got it? It's very simple. Seared salmon, cauliflower cream, and a mussel vinaigrette. Uh, Broxy, they're not those mussels, they're the ones that come from the sea, all right? So um, here's your recipe. I'm gonna, because I'm kind, I'm gonna give you five minutes to have a quick read of the recipe. Familiarize yourself with it, get to know it, make love to it, do whatever you have to do, all right? And then I'm gonna kick you off to cook this dish. At the end of it, bring it to the tasting table. I taste and we work out who the best chef is at the Melbourne Victory. Did you say 20 minutes? 20 minutes. I can't even read this in 20 minutes. <laughs> right boys, you got your recipes, you got all your ingredients. Your 20 minutes starts <laughs> now. Off you go. Can you be careful with your fingers? So, oh, like this. Right. Oh, that's a good technique. Yeah. Done this before. Yeah. 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 I reckon there's more cauliflower on the floor than there is in the pot. Because I mean that that salmon, the last thing we want is uh, overcooked where yeah. it's really dry. Yeah. But undercooked where it's warm. You know so it needs to be that sort of perfect balance. I'll try and get a slow. Oh, yeah. What does it say? Five to seven minutes or something. There we go. Five to seven minutes. Well, fingers crossed. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I hope so. <laughs> I've seen you do it on the show, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, that's what we want to hear, Broxy. Yeah, yeah. Broxy, that's what we call a zen-like sizzle. Right, Victory Cooks, you've got five minutes to go, yeah? Five minutes before I want to see the food up on the pass for tasting, yeah? Broxy, we say yes, chef, yeah? Yes, chef. Yeah, that, that's all, you know? I know. I'm the gaff in here, yeah? You got a minute to go, boys. A minute to go. Well, right. come on. 30 seconds. Get your salmon on. You got nine seconds to go, Nick. I think you can make it. I think you can make it, buddy. Here, mate. Here, here. Drop it there. Drop it there. Yeah. 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 Three. Two, oh, one, that's it. Oh, nice. The cooking challenge is over, boys. <laughs> boys, grab your dishes. Let's go to the tasting table. How do you feel after that? Good. Yeah, comfort. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Broxy, is there anything you're worried about? Um, presentation. There's a, there's a little bit too much vinaigrette in there, but I'm confident that the taste will be delightful. Nick, is that salmon cooked? Yeah, I think that's a fake. It looks good. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. That's plastic. Mitch, you think you've done a done a? You, you, 
<laughs> Actually, Mitch, where's the skin of the salmon gone? It's on the bottom. <laughs> yeah. Interesting. Cooked perfectly. And you can tell that it just sort of flakes apart. Yeah? Beautiful. Beautiful. Guys, Anthony and I are going to need a minute to have a chat, discuss, and work out who the winner is, the champion of today's victory games. Alright? Hold tight, and we'll see you soon. Well, there you have it. What an amazing challenge that was. Victory Games, and uh, you guys had to cook a dish in 20 minutes. Salmon, cauliflower cream, mussel vinaigrette. We tasted. I've now come to my conclusion, and we're gonna announce, first and foremost, the person that came fourth. Basically last. <laughs> Drum roll, that comes to, and they win an amazing Georgie Porgy cookbook basically for kids between 8 and 80, um, Mitch Nichols. Congratulations. Well done, Mitch. Well done, Mitch. Good job. How'd you go? Terrible. But, you know, you, you... I learned something today. Exactly. What did you learn? I can't cook. No, you can cook. You can cook. Will you give it a go at home? Yeah. I'll Maybe for a lady I'll... or two? Oh, <laughs> All right. Third place. This was tough. Because one, two, and three were really close. Line ball, actually. Let's just cut to an ad break. <laughs> In third place, cooking a delicious dish of salmon, but struggled slightly with seasoning, goes to Lee Broxon. Oh, yes. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, George. H how was that? I was a bit disappointed. I thought you were going to look after me, but <laughs> obviously, uh, pretty chummy with Coey and um, Nick cooked with his eyes closed, so it's fine. <laughs> but, uh, thanks, George. Appreciate that. <laughs> right, boys. This is it. The moment of truth. First and second. The winner, the runner up. It comes down to you, Coey, and you, Nick. You both cooked salmon, you both cooked it well. But there was something that had that little bit of edge. And for me, the winner of today's Victory Games MasterChef goes to Nick Ansell. <laughs> Congratulations, well done, mate. How, how do you feel? I know you were sabotaged slightly with the muscle vinaigrette, but your salmon was cooked perfectly. Yeah, I've been practicing a bit, so... Yeah. <laughs> what, what I want to know is how much does this mean to you, to win today, to win this uh, Victory Games? It's a proud moment of mine, and I'll, uh, I'll take it for the rest of my life. Brilliant. It's a good game, it's a good night. Well done, mate. Today, you cooked from the heart. Well done. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, Coey, runner-up, how do you feel? Uh, yeah, not bad, considering I cooked and Nick didn't, but... Uh... Anthony did well, I'll say that. Do you, do you think maybe the top button was, you know, no, dragging you down? To, uh, trying to emulate yourself. F fair you know, enough. You can cook, so I thought I'd uh, try out the first and last go. Well, mate, well, you should be still, you should be very proud of yourself. Runner up. It's, I mean, it, yeah, tough competition today. I did, I did. Anthony's a great chef, so I'm happy with uh, with coming second. Well done. Well, you get a cookbook as well. You.